Alright, ladies and gents, we're just following Gunnerside Beck. We've been walking for about, I don't know, 20 minutes, half an hour, something like that. I've got Jeff with us. Check the sun. Beautiful place is there. Uh, there are buildings and ruins everywhere. Little farmsteads and basil things. Oh. Are we on track? Yep. Yep. Good. Yeah. I think I can see you crossing. On the side was a, an old lead mine. And there's lots of evidence of it. Gunnerside Pasture Woodland Regeneration. It's out trees such as primrose, dog and mercury and wood. And then um, flower and regain. These have been and stuff, some native trees such as birch, rowan, hawthorn have also been planted. Ash woods. Yep. Let's hope it doesn't rain because it's a <laughs> yeah. it's prone area for flash floods. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So this is what I was talking about. You use a path though, can't you? The stairs. Yeah. Some stairs are here, walks. Loads of them! <laughs> Loads! Yeah. Over there. Place where they stored the peat. Because the yeah. they used peat in the olden days as yeah, yeah. fuel. I think I might have stored peat here. I've put something like this and never dry out. Several. Several of them going along. Piece of history.
people heading further up. So we've got a fair way to go to reach the top. And then we'll be sitting and down, find a place to, to pitch up. Bunting mine and dressing floor. Bunting level was the main access into the workings on the east side of Gunnerside Gill and mining was already underway in the 18th, 18th century. The dressing floor was furnished with a fine set of bows teams for storing the lead ore before it was dressed. All the remains of the building included a water powered crushing mill and a smithy. Mm, there's a water source. Yep. That's why they built it. Being a wheel or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, drop that in. Land truck. I noticed there was something there as well. Something's been chipping away. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Little carbons are there. Yeah, so what I must have done was I must have dropped the ore and then chipped away at it to make a Certain shape. Yeah. I wonder if there's any. There must be something online about the process they used to use. It's interesting to find out, right? I don't think they did. Oh, it will be. Yeah, that's definitely mine that way. That was amazing, that. Good. I couldn't have mined that. <laughs> Impossible. Oh, this area is out, that. Yep. Hello? There's not even an egg wall. I know. That means there's nothing there, mate. Hello! Nah, it's blocked. Otherwise, there you go forever. Can he sell the lake? Mm -hmm. Just weird the way the, yeah. the plants are going out the wall. Strange. Across a dead sheep. It's still got skin on and its skin's like bloody leather. See his ribs. Ugh. God knows what's killed that. 
Yuck. Yep. Well, we'll just more or less reach the top. Yeah. Yep. The for that's a dam. We're doing it up there. And what we've done, we used to build dams and channel the water and use it to wash the the rubble away and stuff like that, and you were left with the, the lead off. I don't know if we can get any further along, mate. Right, the folks, we're heading away from the dam. We just come from that way. It's, uh, it's pretty treacherous trying to cross that, uh, that little river. The rocks slippy as hell. Never known there. Uh, rocks would be that slippy. So it's not risk. It's not worth the risk. I'm going to slip and hurt ourselves. Maybe we didn't have a heavy, heavy pack on. See how tricky it is.
Yes, it's weak for rabbit sailor. As you can see. What was night there? Check up there again. Four of them. Two, three, four. No idea what they are. Smelt mill. Output from the mines in the upper part of Gunside Gill increased sharply in 1819 when the new smelt mill was built at Blakethwaite. They began smelting in 1821 but only took ore from the Blakethwaite and Lonethwaite mines. The mill had two ore hearths fueled with locally gathered peat and small amounts of coal. Fumes were drawn into the flue that ran up to a now demolished chimney on the crag above the mill. So that must have been that up there.
犠牲すめだよ。Are you people talking? Uh huh. Southern Cross, one, two and over. Put a crown sheet down. Uh, my multi mat, sleeping bag, uh, got my jet boil there. Food, snacks, the bar, my grease there. My bags at the top there. I always use my bag as a pillar. So that's uh, all me sorted. See if my light works. Yeah, spot on. And then Jeff has just set up over there, next to us. And he's. Um, how do you call him again? Hilliburg Actor. I'm sterilised. I'm losing the sterile thing. We'll use it twice in the bottom. We just go off.
Max. Oh, use. These are me one made dehydrate the meal. This is shepherd's pie. Onion seasoning. Um, dehydrated minced beef. Yeah. Beef more or less dehydrated. Right. And of course, this is going to be hard. One, two, three, three. Yeah, lovely. Mix. There we go. Well, folks, it is very, very cool. Right, 11.